What's going on YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how you can set up Chrome Remote Desktop so you can access your desktop computer from your Android device. First thing you need to do is you need to go into the Play Store of your Android phone and search uh, Remote Desktop. Search Remote Desktop and you should see Chrome Remote Desktop. If you don't want to see this first app, you better uh, type in Chrome first. For me, I don't give a fuck. Hit install. Accept. While that's downloading, go ahead and go on your Google Chrome on your computer. Sorry for the lines. Do the same thing. Search Remote Desktop. This time it should be the first one. Chrome Web Store. Click that. And this will take you to the Google Chrome Web Store. At the top right corner you'll see free, click free, and click add. Bottom of your screen it should start to download, as you can see, it is now downloading. And once that is finished downloading, it will install automatically so you do not have to worry. If you look over at the phone, it is done, so hit open. It says you have no computers registered, that is because we are about to do that. Um, let that add to Chrome or install, whatever you want to call it. Sure, it only take a second, and then it will bring you to your Chrome app page. And you should see a new app here, Chrome Remote Desktop. Click on that. <clears throat> it says you have to grant it permissions. Click continue and accept it down at the bottom. Alright, you're going to see my computer on this page and access your own computer from anywhere. Click get started, you are going on your own computer. Um, at the right click enable remote connections. You will have to create a password. Six digit passwords, hit OK. It says enabling remote connections. Let it do its thing. These lines are very annoying, trust me, I know. Um, you can head over to your phone if you want right now. Whoops. And just wait for this to finish. Remote connection has been enabled. Click OK. You are done on the computer. As you can see, my computers, it will should show the owner or the um, name of your PC. Mine's just called owner and there'll be an option to disable it because right now it is enabled. Look over to your phone, you should see a little bit different. It should show your um, computer at the top. If not, hit the refresh button at the top and you should see the name of your computer, same as on um, the computer itself. Just click that, it'll connect, enter your password, And connect <clears throat> and there we are this is the same screen on both pages um, there'll be a mouse in the middle uh, you just click and drag anywhere to move the mouse around and just tap the screen to click so if you want to go to the top and close this page you can you're done on that page um, you can move the mouse around uh, let's see here I don't know if you can see um, the mouse is moving at the center of the screen and both things. Um, I can go up here and click Google Chrome. You know, search whatever I want. Go on whatever I want. And close that. Well, there I have it, the computer. If I want to go to the My Start, play some games on here, I wouldn't recommend it. It's probably not the fastest um, thing to do. But there you are. I'm rem accessing my desktop computer remotely from my Android device just like that comment rate and subscribe yeah